Senior NCOs lead busy lives. This group of first sergeants, master sergeants, and sergeants major from the Armor School made time during their pre-dawn hours for the Armor School Physical Training Challenge. The objective, one team from each Armor School unit must make it through the events in the shortest time possible. The 10 teams start out with a mile run challenge and at the end, they must assemble a SCEDCO, load it with sandbags, and then take off into the woods for another mile. This is immediately followed by a 25 meter Humvee push, a kickstart to the PT challenge designed by Armor School Command Sergeant Major Michael Clemens. Clemens' goal is to challenge his senior NCOs to be fit and ready for anything. So I try to find new things to do, keep it interesting, keep them guessing so they don't know exactly what's coming up and they have to try to focus on a lot of different things rather than concentrating being good on one thing. Immediately after the physical exertion, teams must complete a written test quizzing them on basic soldier knowledge. The number of questions they answer correctly determine how many rounds they receive for the next event, a paintball shoot. As teams step to the firing line, they know this is the last chance to improve their score because for every hit on the target, time is deducted from their final tally. Once an enlisted soldier reaches the rank of E8, expectations are high. The Army needs that soldier to lead others, not only with knowledge and experience, but even physically, often having to keep up with soldiers half their age. You gotta be physically fit for every one of these we do each quarter, because there's always gonna be a physically challenging aspect of it before you go into the part that requires group thinking or individual thinking. The quarterly PT challenges are also aimed toward team building and increasing camaraderie, while at the same time reinforcing Army values. Well, the expectation for a senior NCO is that, you know, they're able to complete all the tasks that we'd ask of any soldier. And the events are designed to be things that are that you could find on the battlefield that you could potentially have to do someplace and to be functional rather than just the uh, standard push-ups, sit-ups, or a run, combining a lot of different functional fitness and different training into one event. First Squadron 16th Cavalry take today's prize, a personalized mug in Fiddler's Green, the Armor School's bar at the Benning Club. They also walk away with bragging rights until next quarter's challenge. David Wright, Fort Benning TV.